All right, so here I'm showing off is my uncle's Made in USA Dirk Devil Plus by Royal Handvac. I'm not exactly sure how long he's had this machine for, but I'm sure he's had it since it was new. I'm also not exactly sure if he's had this Handvac longer than his other one which is this one, the 120, or he might have had this one longer than the other one. But I'm pretty sure though, however, this one actually came with the accessories for it. I showed these off here in my other video when I demoed or showed off this 120 hand vac. You can just simply scroll through my channel and find it. Or you could just click on the link below in my video. So basically it's pretty much the exact same machine as this one. However, the only difference is between the two other than the name and the looks of the auto bag as well. Not to mention that this possibly came with the accessories. I'm sure some, someone can um, clarify that for me. This one has a two speed switch. So you can switch it from low or a high with this one along with the other um, um, one or three style handbags it just has the one speed selector but again um, it's basically the exact same machines um, I mean same colors they use the same motors um, they both draw the same amperage wise they both take the same bags they both take the same belts so yeah, both of these use um, genuine type G bags. So we flip these over. As you can see here, they both have the same amps. Also, one other difference between these two is this one has a, a wooden brush roll and this one doesn't. Um, it is possible that maybe this one came with a wooden style brush roll. And if that be the case, then I assume that this one's probably newer than this one. Or it could be that this is a replacement brush roll. Because I know for sure on uh, my other uncle's uh, Dirt Devil 120 handbag, which I've also got on my channel, um, his... Um, originally had the same brush as this, but uh, not too long ago, I just recently replaced the brush so it's also now has the wooden brush roll as this one. So, so yeah, again, everything is the same. Shows how to replace the belt on both of these. So, other than that, not a whole lot to talk about this, but um, the reason why he has two of these here is because um, this one actually belongs out in his camping trailer that he has. Well, actually, originally at his other house uh, a while ago, he originally had both of those there. But I suggested to my uncle one day that um, he could probably take one of these handbags and go use out in the trailer because there's no point of having uh, two handbags inside the house. So, yeah, that's what he has been using out there. And I just brought this in just to uh, show off here. I can tell that's been used um, a few times because it's got dirt inside the bag. But I don't think the bag has been replaced since I changed it last, which would have been quite a while ago. 
So, unlike the last time that I showed this machine off, I did not uh, demonstrate using the attachment hose with this. But this time I will, and I would only um, uh, do it with this one, though, since they both take the, uh, the same amps, um, in the sense they both use the same motors, um, it's just not going to be anything different, so what's the point? But I will, however, still go ahead and and plug this thing again and turn it on just to show that um, they both run exactly the same. So overall, um, just like this one, my other uncles, and of course my grandfather's is one or three hand back. Um, I've always loved these things so much. Um, I love the way they look. Um, they are so fun to use. Um, they're very powerful. They get the job well done. They sound pleasant to use and just um, American made. It's one of the um, best handbags that I've ever used. Um, probably the, the second best that I should say. I think probably the overall best that I've used would be a, a Royal Prince handbag, which is basically the metal version of these. So other than that, I will go ahead and plug both of these in and we'll give a quick demonstration. So that's one. That's the other as well. And also they both take the exact same plugs as well. I'm pretty sure my other uncles and my grandfathers um, use different plugs than these as well. Start with this one. So just the one speed switch. Now with this one, I'll start on low. We'll show that again. Maybe this one a little bit more high pitch, and that's probably because this has a more dirtier bag than this one. But again, it's the exact same thing. So, all right, I'll go ahead and take the belt off of here and I'll plug the hose in. So give me one sec. Okay, so it's actually just pretty easy and you just Pop it in like that, and just like that, you just go ahead and flip the switch on. I also really do like um, these hoses as well. Um, they feel really good. Um, it's not like a, a wire reinforced hose that like cuts the airflow off of here. And um, extension one is not very long, but with the hand bag, it's pretty exceptional. Um, decent dusting brush. Um, I've used better before and but I'd say that I might do like this crevice too as well but anyways let's go ahead and flip this on I'll start on low first And high speed. Yeah. 
actually started sounding a little rough. Um, give me one sec. I'd like to check something really quick. Okay, never mind. It just sounded a little rough when I was using the hose with this. So, anyways, um, other than just by using the hand vac itself, I'm not really a fan of using the, the hose on this. Um, it... Airflow wise, um, I mean, it's, it's decent. I mean, it works, but suction wise, it's horrible. Um, like I personally, um, would not, um, want to use attachments with this. And personally, um, if it was just me, I just go buy a regular hand vac instead. Um, I personally, or just a regular, um, Dirt Devil 103 or 120 over buying the plus because I personally wouldn't want to use the hose. And of course, um, I'm not really a fan of having um, two speed selectors on the thing because I would rarely or almost never use the other low speed. Um, um, before I cut off, um, I just um, sprinkled a little more dirt here from changing the hose on this. So I'll demonstrate the, the vibration on this um, one last time here. And of course that also just shows that the thing um, runs smooth as well. So other than that, um, that's my uncle's other Dirt Devil hand vac that he owns. Hope you enjoy this video.